Probability iPhone, iPad and iTouch application covers cumulative distribution function, probability density function or PDF and p-value. Let's start with CDF, cumulative distribution function. It covers Fisher F distribution, normal distribution, standard normal distribution and students T distribution, Fisher F distribution. So numerator degree of freedom 3. Denominator degree of freedom, x value between 0 and 1, 0 0.5, 0 0.5, and we calculate that. Okay, so that is the CDF or the feature F distribution. Normal distribution, 0.2 is x value, so 0 0.2, mean is 0.7 standard deviation 0.4 sorry 5 and now that is the cdf of the normal distribution standard normal distribution say 0 0.7 is the x value we will calculate and that is the cdf students t distribution 0 0.7 is t value degree of freedom 3 and that is the CDF. Now we have seen CDF. Let us move to PDF probability distribution function. We we'll start with chi square distribution. Chi square value is 0 0.7. Degree of freedom is uh, 3. And that is the PDF of chi square distribution. Fisher F distribution 3. Denominator degree of freedom is 5. X value is 0 0.6. And that is the PDF of Fisher F. Normal distribution x value 0 0.7, mean is 2, standard deviation is 0 0.8, and that is the PDF value. So, students t distribution t value 0 0.7, degree of freedom is 3. So, that is the PDF. So p value, chi square test 0 0.7, chi square value, degree of freedom is 3, so that is the p value. Correlation coefficient is a 0 0.7, it should could be between minus 1 and plus 1, degree of freedom is 3. So that is the one tail probability, this is the two tail probability. Fisher F test 0 0.3, 3 and 5. Okay, that's the p-value. These are exact tests. So, 3, 4, 2, 5, and 7. That is the probability, one tail probability for Fisher exact test. Normal curve cumulative. So, g score B is 0.7. So, it can be between minus 7 and plus 7. So, that is the cumulative area. Cumulative one tail. 0.7 again. So that is the one tail. Cumulative so p value two tail again 0.7. Okay. Now significance of mediation. A is seven. S C A is 0.7. B is eight, and S C B is 0.8. Okay. So that is the Sobel test. Arion test and Kudman test. Let me give another example. So this is 5 and this is 1, 2, this is 9, this is 7, 6, 7, 8. So let us calculate. See what we get. We also get some low values. So I give 4, give 3 and see what we get. So we get some values. Okay, significance of mediation, students t test, t value 0 0.7, degree of freedom is 3, and that's the one tail probability and two tail probability. So now let us talk about the inverses, inverse chi square test, one tail probability 0 0.7, degree of freedom is 3, and that is the chi square value. 
So inverse Fisher F test. So probability is 0.7. So numerator degree of freedom is 3. Denominator degree of freedom is 5. So we calculate and that's the F value. So normal curve, inverse normal curve. So we can calculate cumulative one tail or two tail. So 0.7 is the probability and that is the cumulative probability. So this is the corresponding P value. So 0.7 and if it is a one tail, this is what we get. If it's two tail, this is what we get. Okay. What we just covered is we covered probability CDF, cumulative distribution function, probability density function, and p value. So this application is also available in the Android platform. Please visit businesscompassllc.com for more information about this app and other apps. A related great statistical application is mobile statistics professor you go to that through science and engineering and statistics and and this is a comprehensive uh, statistical application for college and mba students so it pretty much covers all aspects of probability and uh, this is available both in the android platform and the ios platform thank you very much